Yes, I am shook. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, QC, and I'm back here with another video for y'all. I know I highlighted and contoured and used my foundation in a totally different way, and I hope you guys definitely enjoy that. Um, so stay tuned if you guys want to see this glow. Like, this is glowing. <laughs> that thumbs up button. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Subscribe, 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 guys. It's free to subscribe. That post notification bell just to be notified whenever your girl upload another look. And I hope you enjoy this. Bye. Hey, what's up, guys? So we're going to start by priming our face with this Wet n Wild primer. I already moisturized. Um, but we're going to do things a little different, so watch really close, guys. Now, I usually start off with my eyes, but today we're going to start off with our face, and I'm going to use that as my contour. This is my Superstay Maybelline Foundation Stick in the shade 370. I'm just going to contour my face. Yes, I did my nose with cream contour, guys. Now, I'm only applying this foundation, my Maybelline Superstay Foundation in the shade 362. I'm going to apply that right under that contour. Nowhere else. I'm just going to put this Tarte Shape Tape Concealer under my eyes, all my highlight points under my eyes, over my nose, my forehead, chin, and cupid's bow. This is the shade Deep. I used the Tarte Shape Tape last because it dries really fast and I was using a brush to blend out. But this brush was not doing it, so I had to switch to my Real Techniques brush and blend out. Now I'm going to go in and blend out my contour. I'm blending this all over my eyebrow and down into that concealer, up into that concealer. So now that I have everything blended, I'm going to go into my Ulta Contour Kit and I'm going to use Bombshell just to set those eyelids. And to set my other highlighted points, I just went ahead and used my Airspun, but I also mixed it with my Maybelline Fit Me in three, nope, sorry, Maybelline Fit Me in deep. And I'm just going to set under my eyes, basically everywhere you put that highlighted contour, which is your concealer, your light concealer. Now we go back into that Ulta Contour Kit and we're going to use Goddess Bronze just to bronze up our face, put all that color back into our face because I was looking a little too light. So I'm using padding motions guys, pat, 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 pat. And then when I get to my cheeks, I use circular motions and it just gives it a better blend. Now we're not completely blended yet, but we're gonna start working on our eyes. And I'm gonna use my NYX Liquid Black Liner just to create that wing.
and I'm gonna go right on top of that with my wet and wild lipstick I've used this before in oh my dolly I just love this pink color now we're gonna prep our lashes with this eyelash gel and my wet and wild cat eye mascara now I'm gonna go underline my eye this is under my waterline I'm gonna apply that white liner then on my waterline I'm going to apply my black liner Now we're going into the matte book. What would a tutorial be without my matte book, guys? So that white liner was just a base for my underline. It's not a usual thing to do, but I just really wanted this color to pop, pop, like really pop. Now I don't know what this is. It's a de okay, I know what it is, but I don't know where I got it from. So it's not gonna be in the description below. I just found a really high pigmented yellow or goldish yellow and I use it for my in the corners now we're gonna go ahead and finish our blending on our face because our eyes are completely done now wasn't that easy I'm just gonna go ahead and set my whole entire face with this is Maybelline Superstay better skin powder in the shade 95 it was just it gave it a really nice blend blend Now I'm gonna use this Morphe Mist. Oh, it smells so good, guys. I'm just gonna pat all of that into my skin, make sure everything is flawless, the way I like it. Now I just went to this Tardis Pro palette just for a highlighter on my brow bone. Then I go on with a different highlighter, which is this Wet n Wild one. I never remember the name of this, guys, and I'm so sorry. But it will be in the description down below, so go ahead and read that. And I did use a lighter color for blush just to play. It's okay to play in your makeup and have fun. And I blend all that into my skin. I add some brown lighter liner to these lips. Then I go on top of that with my Wet n Wild Oh My Dolly, the same thing we used on our eyes, guys, just to have a beautiful color. And that's the end of the tutorial, guys. I hope you guys really, really, really like this one. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell. Let's get into these slow-mos.